cities. Well, I think, you know, my, my career has been around women and building. So um, I think anything where women, I think, to be quite honest, women have been building since the beginning of mankind, when uh, we were out there building caves and then mud huts while they sat around the fire. But so whatever we build, whether it's our spirits, whether it's our homes, whether it's our cities, we need to support each other. And I'm writing a book at the moment, and there's a lot of women who don't support each other. And we have to, that's our only weakness, I think. And once we get over that, that we're all in this together, all the men can leave now. <laughs> But women building a city, to me, what that meant when I heard it, Justine, was that because we are the heart, the home, the family, it's raising responsible kids, being part of our communities through, you know, the modern versions of the PTA, knowing what's going on in your neighborhood, caring about the people down the street, and just basically caring about each other and getting that contact once again. That women, that, that we understand looking at things on a more micro level uh, than macro and, and we look at where things start from and how to make the changes in a very small way. We see this increasingly in our business where the people that we're dealing with are not men at all. The decision makers and the planners and the people making the design and building decisions are all, are all women. So I think that's